Hello and welcome to Prudent Media News. First, we take a look at the headlines. Party needs more time to decide about Shripad and CM candidate circumstances to decide about the rejected candidates joining BJP from Congress. Arun Jaitley tells Prudent in an exclusive interview. Jitendra Desh Prabhu joins Congress, faces severe opposition to his candidature in Porvuri. Porvuri Congress bloc threatens to tender mass resignations. BJP's Jan Samparak Abhiyan begins in the state. Arun Jaitley flags off the Abhiyan calls for change in the government. I-League Giants Dempo Sports Club set for foreign boost. Sporting put Korean on trials as a one-month transfer window opens in India. Salgonkar and Churchill Brothers rule out new signings. And Royal Challengers Margaon defeat Iqbal 11 in Babu Brothers. 2020 Finals Damodar Redkar wins Man of the Series award. And now the news in detail. Leader of opposition in Rajya Sabha, Arun Jaitley, in an exclusive interview to Prudent, revealed that the BJP needs more time to decide about Shripad's Naik candidature and the party's CM candidate. He said that circumstances will decide future or of aspirants who will be joining the BJP after getting rejection from the Congress. You are saying there is no doubt in the mind of the party regarding this issue, whether he should come back to local politics or he should stay at the well, uh, Siripath is a man of great talent. He is a solid organizational man. He has great utility in the centre. He is a very eminent, he is a very senior member of parliament. And therefore, the party will utilize him in the best manner that it considers fit. Mm -hmm. The point is that we don't have to unnecessarily create a controversy where none exists. Mm -hmm. We've run governments in the past. We've had some leaders in the state, some leaders in the center. And both have made a, a huge contribution to the party. Mm -hmm. This is the first time you are saying that you will not announce CM candidate and go for the election. We have not said anything of this kind. Let the elections... Uh, uh, campaign pick up, the party will take a decision and announce whatever it thinks best in the interest of the campaign. So right now there is n nothing is decided on this issue. Why, why do you say that? After all, decision is not a surgical process. So what will be your stand as far as those candidates are concerned who will be rejected by the Congress? If they come to your party, what will well, be your stand? I, This is a matter of electoral strategy. Hmm. Our normal preference is for our own political workers. Our preference is for men of integrity. <clears throat> Our preference is also on winnability. Mm -hmm. So if they come to us in constituencies where we have strong and we have very, very winnable candidates, the answer is no. Mm -hmm. But uh, at, in some rare exception, yeah. it may be a point of strategy, though it's not a matter of preference. Mm -hmm. Can BJP think of coming to power alone in this situation or you need an alliance? Well, I think it's, it's, it's a matter of strategy. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 alliance, we may come to power on our own. We have in the past come to power on our own. But at times you enter into alliance in order to avoid a vote split. Yeah. So that you enjoy a comfortable majority. And therefore uh, uh, alliances are always, uh, uh, they are a force multiplier. Mm. Uh, and therefore if alliances do take place, uh, I think it only ensures not only the victory but also the margin of victory. Bureau Report, Prudent Media. Jitendra Desh Prabhu joined back Congress on Monday. Desh Prabhu is interested in contesting from Porvuri constituency. GPCC President Subhash Shirodkar said that illegal mining allegation against Desh Prabhu will not hamper the party's prospects. On the other side, Porvuri Bloc Congress has threatened to resign en masse if Desh Prabhu is given the Porvuri ticket. Jitendra Desh Prabhu was loaned out to the NCP in 2009 for Lok Sabha election. Now, after three years, Desh Prabhu is back in the Congress. He has clarified that he has no role in the illegal mining. He is aspiring for Parvari ticket. Desh Prabhu feels that a new constituency like Parvari should be won by Congress. Desh Prabhu is optimistic about Dayanand Narvekar's cooperation. He will be gracious to support me and help me. Tomorrow I will do something at home and in my bagan and bagiche. If I get food, then will I be able to believe it? I don't have permission. Permission, 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 whatever things are, वो ले चुके थे 
लेकिन फिर भी जो भी हुआ है सब लोगों को जानकारी होगी Subhash Shirodkar is confident that illegal mining episode involving Desh Prabhu will not affect the Congress party. He also admitted that clean personalities are rare in politics. Taje sagal purna vichar karun ami taka parat Congress pakshan kiti nasa. Tumga effect jaute na election. Election. Jaute na. See aaj cha aaj cha paper a chair pore dutle tanda sari kon nash mutla. BJP cha ek motya leadran mutla ki even our party has got hardly 65 to 70 percent nash mutla. तो ताजोर तो ऐसा ऐसा कि थई सुधा करप्शन ऐसा, थई सुधा प्रश्नाचार ऐसा, अंत्या मुझे हर एक पार्टी की जवाबदारी जाओ ना सा, ये कमीत कमीया में कश्मीर तले, ये निवासन कश्मीर द्वार तले। On the other side, whole Parvari Block Congress is against Desh Prabhu's candidature from Parvari. Parvari Block Congress has threatened to resign in large numbers if ticket goes to Desh Prabhu. Four names have already sent to the High Command. जो आलित, जो कंट्रोवर्शियल माइनिंग इतन तो आता है हमका नील जो कैंडिडेट अजीबात ना का या मैं कांग्रेस एक सरल सामुंग सत्ता टेंटेड हमका कैंडिडेट दूं ना का इतने जो कौन प्रामाणिक पाने जो का उम्मीद था लोकाजी सेवा कर पाजी कार्य कर पाजी इतने जो एक कैंडिडेट दूं तो आ रिपोर्टर फ्रॉम पंजी लोकिक शिल्कार विद वीडियो जर्नलिस्ट ओमकार फ BJP's Jan Sampark Abhiyan began from Monday in the capital city. The Abhiyan was flagged off by the leader of opposition in Rajya Sabha, Arun Jetli. Jetli criticized the Congress government and called for change in the government. The Abhiyan will be held in all constituencies for the next 15 days. Jan Sampark Abhiyan of the Bharatiya Janata Party began on Monday from Azad Maidan in Panji. Opposition leader in the Rajya Sabha, Arun Jetli. Opposition leader in Goa, Manohar Parikar. State President Lakshmikant Parsekar, North Goa MP Shripad Naik and other BJP workers were present at the Abhiyan. Jetli called for a change in the government. I would like to say that in this journey, you will be able to do the people of Goa that the power of your power that you have not got the power of this kind of power. The power of Goa's power of the people of Goa गोवा की जनता को शासन मिले उसका स्तर क्या होना चाहिए इससे जनता को अवगत करवाएं और गोवा की राजनीति में और यहाँ की राजनीतिक सभ्यता और संस्कृति में एक परिवर्तन लाने का हम लोग प्रयास करें अब सुन यार तीन वर्ष वो अत्यंत हमका महत्व चाहता तो ऐतिहासिक दिशा तो वो अंत्या ऐतिहासिक दिशा कोई चे North Goa MP Shripad Naik, who is one of the aspirants from Pororim constituency, said that only BJP can give a clean and non-corrupt government in the state. Hey, the Congress Chief Minister Amdar Asad, he is totally Asad. He is with us, 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 जातुन भीतर जाल और कांसो गोया भीतर इंटरेस्ट आसा में ते हिंदू आसा मुस्लिम आसा कैथलिक आसा ये सगे ये कत्र योन ये के कड़े योन गोया करांग ये नवे परन्तु एक दा ब्राइट फ्यूचर दिवाचा दृष्टि आई जिया यात्री जी शुरुआत में आगे करी आसा आर रिपोर्टर फ्रॉम पंजी जेसन स्वारेज विद वीडियो जर्नलिस्ट दिवेंद्र गांव it's time now for a short break. Stay tuned.